coming around the wicket to Jake Weatherall. Weatherall back, and there's an appeal for court behind, and he's gone. 50, I thought. Line in, and this ball has bowled him. Ferguson waits for him to deliver. Hit him on the pad. This looks close indeed. No. Line into head. It's fuller, and it's punched down towards mid on It beats Harry Conway and races its way down to the fence for four. Line in and Ferguson sweeping down to fine leg. There's no one there. And that will run away for four. Over the wicket to head and heads. Oh, out. Oh, no. Waits for Copeland. That's an interesting shot by head. It's a good length ball sort of coming back at head. And he just almost moved to the onside and worked it behind point on the offside for four. Conway, short ball and heads out. Oh, he's dropped again. Line. It's a short ball and heads slashing away and it's found the outside edge. It's going to run away for four to the third man boundary. This is slapped. That is a big, big shot. High and handsome over mid-wicket for six. It's out of the ground, in fact. Short ball, which he guides over the top of the point and gully region for four. So ten runs in two balls. Hatcher into Ferguson, who flays that through gully. That is a fantastic shot for four. Just leant back and cracked it through the gap between gully and backward point. Sanger in, short and pulled hard out through mid-wicket. That's four more. Too short from Sanger. And Head says, thank you very much, sir, and crunches it through the mid-wicket region. And it's a 50 for Travis Head as well. So a fantastic innings. Wasn't able to make a clear decision. Hunt, uh, Head is back and cutting beautifully. Out through cover, down to the rope for four. Wicket's in the first innings. Now the short ball heads swiveling on that. It's in the air and hatches. All right, here's line into Cooper who drives through the offside and that's going to go away for four. Here's Conway, pitches up and Ferguson drives down the ground for four. That's a lovely shot from Ferguson. Line again. Play through the offside, beats the field up. It's going to be a race to the boundary. I do run three though. Much more aggressive stroke there. Steams in from the school end. Ferguson drives at that one, punches the gap in the field. It's going to be a foot race, but Daniel Hughes is not going to get there. Played oh, great shot. beautifully square on the leg side, and that'll race away after beating the inner field. As Copeland comes in, an expansive drive, beautifully done out through cover. That's probably one of the shots of the day from Tom Cooper. Over Edwards. Charges into Ferguson, who uppercuts that backward a point. It was in the air, but he kept it away from the infield. We get a boundary. Copeland to Cooper, who lofts handsomely over mid on for six. That's a cracking stroke. Lyons skips into Ferguson, who sweeps hard and beautifully towards the square leg fence for four. Into Ferguson, forward and driving and driving excellently out through cover. That's going to be another boundary. He's looking in fine, fine touch, Callum Ferguson. Edwards to Cooper is cutting. It's a thick outside edge down to the third man rope for four more. To Cooper. He bowls and Cooper pulls at this and it's gone down to fine leg and it's gone for four. Strike. Lion bowls. He's reverse sweeping this and there's going to be runs for him here as it's flying down past the vacant slip region for four. And hatches in. And this is pulled from Cooper. There's a big appeal and he's given out. Hatcher bowls. And this one's flag. He's caught. Caught behind. To Nielsen. Who's... Oh, and it's given out. Certainly was as Copeland looking to get more. And he's chopped on. Around Wes's technique at the time. Lyon into Pope. And surely will it be? It is out. It's over. Lyon gets the final wicket. Lloyd Pope departs for a duck. No shot offered. Indeed, it was Lyon picking up his third wicket and sending the New South Wales Blues to an almost unsurmountable lead.